description on the website I think that stuck out to me when I was looking through the website was um, the summer opportunities that came with the program. The ability to travel, the um, opportunities that I was going to have to see all the different communities in the Navy, there were a lot of opportunities and there were a lot of exciting opportunities. The summer experience that happens after freshman year is called Cortramed. You spend a week in the aviation community, uh, a week with the surface warfare community, a week in the submarine community, and a week in the Marine Corps community. It's a, a time for uh, naval midshipmen to experience the, the feel of each community as well as get exposure to the kinds of uh, equipment that you know people maybe use. Also have you know interaction with officers and enlisted and, and figure out you know who's got what responsibility. After the sophomore year of college, uh, Typically, Naval ROTC midshipmen go on another cruise. Um, it can be like a two to three week cruise in a specific community. I had the opportunity to um, go on a program that was called Project Go. It's uh, funded by the Department of Defense and it's a foreign language program. The uh, program that I applied to and was accepted to was based at, out in T Tempe, Arizona at ASU, Arizona State University. And um, it was uh, two months. And then the third month during the summer, they actually sent us over to Russia. They uh, want future officers to experience uh, foreign cultures because, you know, as officers, we're going to be traveling the world throughout our career. So uh, the summer after junior year, I went on what's called first class cruise, which everybody's required to take in order to graduate in commission. And so my cruise, uh, I was on a submarine for 12 days with eight other female midshipmen from a combination of the Naval Academy and other universities across the country. Just hanging out on the submarine, asking questions, interacting with the crew, and uh, trying to get a feel for what submarine life was like.